Hello guys and welcome back. Today we have a job on a Nintendo Switch. We've already concluded that the uh, problem is the charging AC chip. Uh, we check the connections on the USB right here. Of course from the other side and also the battery and it's still not charging so the only thing I, I there's no short uh, we'll make another video in the future about checking for shorts <clears throat> however right now we're gonna go ahead and replace this particular chip uh, we're gonna go ahead and remove it and replace it with a new one uh, we've done this in the past before however today I decided I wanted to make a video about it as time progresses we will uh, demonstrate uh, disassembly and also assembly uh, but that's the easy stuff uh, so let's get started with the uh, with our heat station here and our heat uh, soldering iron so let's remove this ch particular chip at this, at this moment and then we'll go ahead and clean it up and then put the other one on there actually we're just going to remove it and place the other one right away take advantage of the heat then we'll use some uh, solder paste on the sides so that uh, we can bond that chip back together okay so here I'm applying 850 degrees Fahrenheit a little over a half of, uh, of the uh, air, air uh, on, the, on the heat gun as soon as you see the uh, solder here start getting shiny, you, you know that it's time to remove that chip. Lift. Align in place. And the chip is in place now. The chip itself positions itself in the right place if you just allow it to flow. Uh, I didn't use a lot of flux there, but we will add a little flux. And then you see that the dot here corresponds to the dot up here, right there. So at this point, even though the chip looks good, we want to make sure that the there is touching the actual uh, solder on there perfectly. So we're going to use some mechanic solder paste. And our previous videos have shown that this thing, this thing is pretty pretty good. You don't want too much, you just want enough. Again, this is uh, this is not the first time I've, I've replaced these chips. And I know this will fix this particular issue, at least I hope. If not, we'll look somewhere else. However, it is very, very common after you check for shorts and uh, and the usual stuff. And this just fail often. So you want to usually get some more heat and do this at the same time. I should have taped the board on there, but we're, we're fine. I 
Actually, let me put a little bit of tape on there so it can work better. The board is moving all over. So we'll simply put some tape across and secure the board in place. This is what I did. So we're just putting the board on a piece of uh, plate here to just secure it a little bit in for it not to wobble. Don't be scared of this particular uh, globs of, uh, of solder. They usually come off with the heat again. And with your solder iron, it, it takes some some practice, but it, it can easily be done, okay? So we want to get this here touching. Okay? Clean your tip. Clean, clean. And if you're having a little bit of trouble removing the solder, simply get some Kenwick from Chemtronics and gently apply it on the side here. And this thing works magic. See that? So there's a little blob there which is fine. Points look fine there. Just turn it over and continue to check. Everything looks good right here. Everything looks good on this end. And on this end as well. I will zoom in a little bit. Or somewhere around there. Hopefully you guys can see that well. As, as high as my microscope zooms in. But the job is good. And if we wanted to, we could remove the little ball from there and make some more mess. Like so. So we will now go ahead and clean it up and test it. All 
I use alcohol, 99%. And I found this bamboo chip, uh, bamboo, bamboo Q-tips that stay pretty solid and uh, work really well. If you guys have any questions, you can write them on the comments. You can visit our website at yayao.org. W A Y A Y E O dot org for services, help, assistance. We are here to help. I hope you guys enjoyed this video and learned something from it. I'm going to go ahead and assemble it, put it together test it and if for any reason the problem is it's not this then now that'll be another chance to make a video see you guys soon thank you for watching subscribe and hit like bye bye